35F CPU and a GB of RAM. The Lenovo IdeaCAD 100S offers really solid performance that's good enough for web surfing, editing documents, viewing movies and multitasking. When I had a dozen Chrome browser tabs open, I was able to watch a YouTube trailer of Star Wars, The Force Awakens in one window while editing the Google Doc in another, without a hint of lag. Performance was equally smooth when 100S was playing an offline clip in Windows Media Player. The IdeaCAD 100S scored a solid 2195 on Geekbench 3, the synthetic benchmark that measures overall performance. That's on PAR with the Asus eBook X205 to 2212 which has the same CPU as the 100S, but nearly double the Celeron N3050 powered Acer Aspire 1 CloudBook 11S mark of 1285. The IdeaCAD 100S S30 to GB of them storage memory took 2 minutes and 24 seconds to complete the laptop file transfer test, which involves copying 4.97 GB of mixed media files. That's a rate of 31 MBPs, which is a little less than you'd get with most mechanical hard drives, and also slower than the CloudBook 11 34.6 MBPs and the X205 to 41.4 MBPs. Forget about crunching large sets of data on this low-cost laptop. The IdeaCAD 100S took a glacial 22 minutes and 5 seconds to complete the OpenOffice spreadsheet test, which matches 20,000 names with their addresses. The X205 TA took a similar 21 minutes and 36 seconds, but the CloudBook 11, which is slower on other benchmarks, finished in just 11 minutes and 54 seconds. You can watch movies on the IdeaCAD 100S, but forget about gaming. Lenovo's low-cost laptop scored 15,081 on 3D Mark Ice Storm Unlimited, the synthetic graphics benchmark. That's about the same as the X205 top 15,111 but a bit behind the CloudBook 11 18,314. Battery life The IdeaCAD 100S lasted a strong 9 hours and 48 minutes on the length top battery test, which involves continuous web surfing over WIFI at 100 nits of brightness. That's well ahead of the Acer CloudBook 11 test time of 8 hours and 4 minutes. However, the Asus eBook X205 taught lasted a full 1205, while Lenovo's